السلام علیکم فرینڈز آج کی میری ویڈیو کو ٹاپک ہے ایجوکیشن اس سے پہلے ہم ایجو سیئر اور ایجو کیئر کے بارے میں بات کر چکے ہیں اب ہم نیکسٹ آگے چلیں گے انشاءاللہ ان کو پڑھا ہے ویسٹرن تھنکرز کے حوالے سے اور اب ہم اس کی ایجوکیشن کی طرف جانیں گے ہمارے مارڈرن تھنکرز کے حوالے سے کہ وہ کیا کہتے ہیں دیفنیشن آف ایجوکیشن فرام دی پوائنٹ آف ویو آف مارڈرن تھنکرز وٹ دے سی اباؤٹ ایجوکیشن According to Frobel, education is unfoldment of what is already unfolded in the germ. It is the process through which the child makes internal external. According to Pestalozzi, education is the natural, harmonious and passive development of man's innate powers according to Raymond education is a process of development from infancy to maturity the process by which he adopts himself gradually in various ways of his physical and spiritual environment According to John Dewey, education is the development of all those capacities in the individual which will enable him to control his environment and fulfill his responsibilities. According to Thompson, education is the influence of the environment on the individual with a view to produce a permanent change in his habits, behavior of thought and attitude. According to T.P. Nunn, education is the complete development of the individuality of the child so that he can make an original contribution to human life according to the best of his capacity. According to John Adams, education is conscious and deliberate process in which one personality acts upon an other in order to modify the development of that other by the, the communication and manipulation of knowledge.